applied again <laughs> in 2019. Guess what, y'all? I finally got my CJO with my dream airline. And it feels really good to actually go after what you want and get it. Flying with skates, back at it again, here with another great video for you guys today. On this video, I'm gonna show you guys how I'm gonna pack for six weeks of flight attendant training. Shoes, um, jeans, casual clothes, business attire, training attire, workout, makeup, necessities, and bags. So let's get into this video today. Make sure you guys hit the subscribe button if you guys like my video. If you have any videos you want me to record, make sure you guys leave it in the comment, comment box below, okay? Okay, so we are gonna start building our bag. I am going to use the rolling method today to pack all my training clothes, okay? So the first thing you want to bring or pack is the bulky items. So for me, what's bulky will be my jeans. So I have my jeans that's folded up right here. Just some standard denim blue jeans with no rips and no tears, okay? These are actually boot cut. Actually shaped and straight, so. You want to take your jeans, you just want to fold them nice and tight. So here you go. I'm gonna bring about three pair of jeans. My second pair of jeans right here. And then my third pair of jeans, okay? Um, next, I'm gonna put my black slacks in there. I have some standard black slacks. Again, no rips and no tears. I got this a size bigger because I'm on this weight loss journey. So I wanna see how good I'm gonna do. So just a pair of black slacks. Again, we're doing the rolling method. Super easy. So right now I have six pair of pants in this bag. And then I'm gonna bring one navy blue dress just to have options for business casual day. I also have a blue suit that I'm going to bring as well, but it's already dry cleaning on a hanger. I will give you guys a preview of that later on. So moving on, I'm going to bring six collared shirts. So you have a standard collared shirt with no logo, just a plain white polo shirt. I usually get men's or boys small shirts. I got these from Amazon. I will post the link for that below. So again, back to rolling. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I kid, I only, I only bought five white polos. Not a problem. Um, then I have this a standard white shirt for my slacks. Moving on. I do like to go out and have drinks with my classmates. So I'm gonna bring a business or a nice little dress, something fun, super fun and cute. I will show a video of all these items on to give you guys an example of what to bring and what's okay for training. Um, I'm all about packing light and tight. You don't wanna overdo it when it comes to packing because you will have a roommate and you will have to bring back items from training like your training or your your uniform from the airline that you are going to training with, okay? So I'm also gonna bring about seven pairs of loungewear and workout attire, because I do plan on going to the gym while I'm there. New year, new me. And if you guys are going to tr training, congratulations, it's a great feeling. I go to training on Monday and I'm so excited. Today's Saturday. January 4th. I'm so happy guys and it's been a long long road so I'm very excited to go but back to the bag um, you want to roll everything nice and tight you want to have room for your clothes Ooh, that blood. you don't have room for your clothes and your shoes so I'm just layering all of my activewear here like so everything is super neat Okay, Get one more here. Um. 
and this is all my loungewear i bought i think my loungewear outweighs everything because i like to be comfortable and i know i'm gonna have to wash a couple days i need to have like lounge clothes to wear and bring with me um so this is why you see me having more majority of loungewear but I, I'm a firm believer in not overpacking and trying on outfits before I bring them. I will wash throughout this training process. Just to have I just don't want to unpack. Um, I'm there to train, get my wings, not to have a fashion show. But this I is the majority of my clothes. Cool, okay? This is not a long training packing video. Or Tyler. I literally wasn't going to bring a lot of clothes. But this is training. the look. I've been to training before. Get to it. Let's and I know right. for a fact, like, you don't okay. need all those clothes you're going to bring. Yeah, yeah. no face stuff. Okay. So these items are more of, like, my sports. Sports bras, underwear, and socks. So I'm gonna just place everything right here. Super, super cool. Socks, underwear, more sports bras. I packed this bag like four times and it's like the neatest one I've done so far. Funny, right? Okay, so we are officially done with this side. So your bag should look just like this, all nice and tight. Everything is in the bag neatly and in order okay let's get it guys let's go get those wings okay so moving on to the next side the best side um i'm gonna start with my shoes for me personally i hate walking around the hotel with my feet out or my feet in clothes so i brought some sandals for the shower maybe or even for the walking around the hotel room I'm gonna put these at the bottom. This is going right here. I also have my my in-flight shoes, just some standard three-inch heels. Got some BCBG. Twenty dollars, y'all. Winning. I also have some compression socks because I did experience having my feet hurt and my legs hurt when I used to fly. So I'm going to bring that. I also have lotion, Renew from my shopping club that I'm in. Ladies and gentlemen, if you guys get cramps, make sure you guys bring a heating pad. Cause I get cramps and I am not the next person on my period. This nice little baseball cap hat for those bad hair days. You don't like doing your hair or your off day. Um, I also bought 10 pair of knee high stockings because I feel like you can never have too many knee high stockings. Okay. This is my makeup and toiletry bag. I'm gonna just throw this in here. I will do a video later about my toiletry bag. And you also need snack bags, guys. Ziploc bags, you have to get you some of these because, listen, these come in handy for sure. And if you guys follow my Instagram, I'm all about skincare and I literally cannot wash my face with a washcloth. So I have four by four cotton wipes for my skin. I'm gonna put these in a Ziploc bag so I can have them ready for you guys. Because, listen, who wants to deal with that? Not me. So. Ooh, I got the wrong bag. So, ha ha. Taking those back to Target. Just another hat. Just some tights from Target. These are in cocoa. I have my inboard flat shoes. They're in a makeup bag or a reusable hair bag. And 
that. If you, you guys want to have a roommate a lot of times in training, so you want to get an eye mask so that you guys can, or so that you can block out the light in the room when you're trying to take a nap or go to sleep. A lint roller is essential. You will have black one and you will have hair. So go ahead and get you a lint roller for your training. Ooh, I love Charity Pop from Lush. It is the best for moisturizer. You will be drying the air. So let's start now and prepare those and prepare your skin. Boop. That in there. More socks. I also have some SPF. You can never go wrong with that. Some beauty blenders. And a scarf going out shoes and honestly I am done like this is all I'm bringing the training it won't be too much I have um a garment bag for my under under garments and then a laundry bag for all my dirty clothes and then that's pretty much it I'm gonna throw my jacket in there because I need a jacket so All right, this is how my other side of the bag looks. We're all packed and we're ready for training. I'm so excited for training. I can't believe today is Saturday. And it's about to be Monday. It's about to go down. I wish everybody prosperity this year and to get every goal that you want. Just manifest it, create it, and act on it, and you will get whatever your heart desires. Let's go to training, guys. Successfully pass with peace and positivity. Let's go, y'all. Okay. At this point, your bag should look like this. I have all of my jeans all in one row. I have all of my business casual outfits all in one row. Everything's gonna be rolled and tucked neat, as you can see. I'm going to add some gym clothes over here just because I have enough room to do that. And then I have my sleepwear here as well. Um, when you start packing, you find like little holes and areas that you can fold things into. And this is exactly how and what I'm doing. So make sure you guys are rolling neat and rolling tight. Everything should be nice and organized. Organization is key when you are packing. Don't just throw everything in your bag because you will look sloppy and you won't have the ability to fit everything in your bag. Okay. In the end, your bag should look neat and tight. You have everything packed and ready to go for your first day of flight attendant training. You ready, you have extras. You got things ready to go. So, let's see how I did. The real test is when you basically <laughs> zip your bag together. This bag is a heart showcase and let's see how it's in.